Okay, everybody, here we are on our smart car engine, which is the OM660 out of a 2006 smart car. It's a diesel in line three. Uh, I have it out of the chassis, or I guess out of the vehicle, so it's just the frame and the engine, and I've been doing a complete rebuild on it and couldn't find anything about uh, doing the timing chain on this. So after reading a million forum posts and people being like, I don't know how to do it, I finally figured out how to do it and it's actually relatively easy. So what you're gonna need is you're gonna need a square or a level. And the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna line up this little key down here, if you can see that, on the nut to this line right here. And all you have to do is you take your square, you put it up here, put it to the edge of this, take a look along the edge, and if it's straight up and down, if it's straight up and down right here, you're good. So as long as that line is parallel, that means it's marked properly. Next thing you have to do is you take the square as well. You see these two markings right here, one here and here. You make them level with this piece. So you just take this. If the markings are perfectly exact, you're good to go. Okay, right, last thing you're gonna need is the timing uh, chain guide. So you can't actually put the chain on with the guide on, you have to do this in steps. So you put the rear guide on, then you put the timing chain all the way around once you have everything timed up. Then you put this guard on, then you put the uh, tensioner in. If you put this on before trying to put on the chain, you'll never be able to get the chain on. And that's it, it's quite simple. Hopefully this makes life easier for anyone ever trying to do this.